Hey, what's up, YouTube? Uh, this is Casey here with uh, HowToPlayStock.com and InvestorsInvestingTips.com. Um, today, I wanted to shoot a video, and I, I wanted to cover the topic of uh, the three secrets to uh, becoming uh, wealthy and financially free. Okay. Now, before I get started on, on this video, I want to uh, cover a quote that I heard from, again, it's Warren Buffett, one of the, uh, the most famous investors, most greatest investors of all time. Um, and I, I wanted to cover this quote because it has to do with habits. And the three secrets that I'm going to show you today have to do with habits. And uh, with that being said, here, here's the quote. Uh, the change of habit are too weak to be felt until they're too strong to be broken. So I'll repeat it one more time. The change of habit are too weak to be felt until they're too strong to be broken. All right. Now with that that being said, and with that in mind, I'm going to show you the the three uh, basically habits that I've noticed. Uh, you know, just just for my time investing and making mistakes, the three habits that people like really, you know, just kind of sleep on. Uh, they don't they don't take seriously, um, and it's real simple. I mean, these habits are so simple to follow, but we all break them, um, and we we all sleep on it because it's it's just. I mean, it's their habits. You know, their habits that. Either you follow or, and you obtain through repetition, or they're, they're things that you just kind of let go. Um, so with that being said, here they are. The secrets to financial freedom and, and building wealth. Uh, number one, pay yourself first, all right? Save and invest. So no matter what, like no matter what it comes down to, when it comes to paying your bills, you know, go ahead and pay those, especially if they're necessities to live. But if it's like credit cards, you're in debt up to your eyeballs, you know, look, your debtors, all right, and I've made a video about this before, your debtors can wait, all right, pay yourself first. So when you get paid, take a certain percentage of that money that you get paid and put it aside for yourself, all right, and instead of just saving it cash, you know, if you don't have any cash on hand, well, Put it aside for that first. If you already have that, you know, put aside and you, you've got enough to cover, say, six months to a year, uh, you know, worth of bills and necessities. Um, if you already have that, start taking that money and putting it somewhere, you know, where it's going to uh, compound with interest or, you know, start growing for you when it comes to your wealth. All right. Uh, that's number one. Number two, live below your means. So pay off your debt, okay? So if you don't have your debt paid off yet, I've made a video about this. You can go check it, uh, you know, in, in my video list. Or I'll actually, as a matter of fact, uh, I'm going to leave a link in the, the right-hand uh, portion of this video or the left-hand portion. I'm kind of confused in my right and left right now. It's the right-hand portion in my right-hand portion of the video here. Click a link, uh, and it there's a video. Uh, where I go over paying off your debt, all right, and I show you how to do that. So if you if you have a problem right now and you're in debt, check that video out because it's going to show you how to do it. Um, I paid I paid off twenty two thousand dollars in two years because I I knew how to you know handle my creditors and I knew the approach to take for paying off my debt. So if you're in that situation right now, check it out. Okay, um, that's number two. Live below your means. All right, and uh, I'm talking about lifestyles here. I'm talking about, um, you know, knowing your financial statement. And I made a video on that one too that you can go check out, where, you know, it comes down to basically knowing uh, where your money's going, every single penny, every single dollar of it. Okay, number three here is create healthy habits. All right, now Warren Buffett talks about this in some of his videos or his interviews. And people ask him how he became wealthy. And, you know, one of the things that he mentioned as, as a, a key ingredient to how he became wealthy was he said he had time on his hands. 
he was able to stay healthy. All right, because if you're able to stay stay healthy and you don't have a lot of health complications uh, taking place as you grow older, well, you're going to be able to do a lot more than say somebody who has you know cancer or some type of a heart complication, uh, because that that kind of thing, you know, it's not something that you can really can you know, you can't really can control it. Um, you can to a, a certain extent. And what I mean by that is, is by creating healthy habits. So if you can, if you can create healthy habits to, to make yourself healthier over time, you're going to, you're going to have much better chance of living longer, uh, to say than someone who smokes cigarettes or, uh, you know, is binge drinking at the bars like every, every week. So create healthy habits, guys. All right, because that's that's one of the keys to to becoming wealthy. All right, if you can stay out of the hospital, then you've saved yourself money there in in health bills. You know, so those are things the three simple things that you can do. All right, to to help you know get your plan in place and get things moving along a lot faster than say somebody who who just kind of you know puts their head in the sand and and sleeps on these uh, three habits, okay? Because that's what these are, they're habits. It's a habit to pay yourself first. It's a habit to try to develop, you know, develop some type of a, a discipline within yourself to live below your means. It's a habit uh, to, you know, live healthy and live a healthy lifestyle, man. I, I work out, guys, I work out six days a week, okay? I take one day off, you know, sometimes I'll take two, depending on, on what I have going. But for the most part, I'm, we, I'm working out six days a week. And, and <laughs> I'm 35 years old. All right? I get a lot of people that, you know, besides the, the haircut here, you know, and not having any hair, a lot of people will look at me and they're like, dude, you're 35 years old? I'm like, yeah. They're like, you know, I want to look like you. And, and that's not, I'm not trying to brag here or anything like that. I'm just trying to make a point that, you know, I'm 35 years old and I have people who are younger than me and older than me uh, that are coming to me for advice on, you know, things that they should do to uh, improve their health, you know, and, and their lifestyle, you know, from a, a fitness standpoint. Um, so those are, those are things that you can uh, apply to your own life and their habits that, you know, once they take hold, you're going to be... I mean, you're going to be much better off. You're going to be ahead of the curve when it comes to, uh, you know, getting your financial situation under control um, and gaining momentum so that you're building wealth, okay? So that's really, I mean, I, I had this in mind for a little while, and I, I figured, you know what, it's, it's simple stuff that probably everybody knows, but... You know what, I, I think I should probably shoot a video on it because it, these are the three things, I think, just based off of my own experience so far, that people just kind of, they, they put on the back burner and, they, and, you know, they go to sleep on it. You know, I mean, who, who wants to do these things, you know, because they all require some, some sort of a sacrifice when it comes to your lifestyle. Who wants to do that? Who wants to sacrifice? You know, how bad do you want it? It's like Eric Thomas says in some of his videos. Uh, you have to, you have to want it as bad as you want to breathe. You know, you want to, you have to want to succeed as bad as you want to breathe. Okay, and that's really what it comes down to. So develop your habits. Uh, remember these three things: pay yourself first, live below your means, and create healthy habits. All right, guys. Uh, that's all I have for today. Uh, until then, you know, I'm going to release some more videos, but until I do that, keep grinding, keep saving your money and, and start working on these habits. Cause I'm telling you, you know, it, it makes a world of difference. It really does. Um, but that's all I have, uh, until, until next time, I will talk to you guys soon.